mind darlings welcome to your daily mini reading i'm going to do a past present and future potential possibilities uh in the future cards for you uh this is for those that most need to hear the message i am using the guardian angel wisdom tarot we'll see what wishes to come out my darlings uh so and if it resonates it is for you within your divine design for you to hear this message today so thank you let's see what wishes to come out this is this this is the past position for you thank you spirit the star beautiful card for having in the past position because that energy is present today uh for you now let's see present card please thank you spirit present card wishes to come out we have got uh the chariot thank you spirit lovely two major arconas so this is a big life changing moments for you at this present time and then let's have a look at the potential possibilities card please thank you spirit and we have the king of wands has come out as well alongside the ace of wands so the past position the star the star appears when we have gone through a life-changing experience or experiences that have um caused us forced us uh, encouraged us to readdress um us, our life, uh, how we see things, our situation, uh, how we are uh, portraying ourselves, um, how we feel, truly feel about things inside. And the star card is uh, an energy that you've brought into the present moment. That's why you've got the chariot of um, literally, as you know, with the star card, releasing all that doesn't serve you anymore. It might seem easy to sometimes release things that, that don't serve you, but it's actually a lot harder, isn't it, when you go through that process, because sometimes it's just a lot easier to cling on to things that you know aren't quite right for you, but you can't quite um, come round to giving them up. So it is a letting go card. It's releasing into uh, healing for yourself. It is uh, a card that has already shown you that 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 what you thought um, was a very a time that maybe wouldn't have finished, wouldn't have passed. Actually, it is now the end. It's been the end of that challenging time, and you're feeling now that there is movement forward in your life. This is the this is the chariot. So this card is a card of reminding you, my darling, that this wherever you are presently, and there's this energetic push forward, this energetic movement forward for you at this time. This is about you being um, carried along almost by by something that's happening for you. And it is with great excitement too. And it is also uh, not being distracted by maybe things that you were distracted before the star card at this time. So um, whatever this is, this is you, my darling, accomplishing your dreams. This is you, uh, this is a, a success for you in whatever this may be. But it is also because you have learned in this process about really not being in control. These horses, are not being controlled by the archangel there behind them this is the magic of the universe allowing to let go to to let to let the universe take over to trust that all is according to the divine plan to to be spontaneous about things to be at ease with how things are moving within that divine design for you so very very beautiful that's the present moment and the future possibilities because of this ace of wands on the bottom of the deck here, which is really rather lovely, you're repotting yourself. I'm getting you're kind of repotting yourself into a bigger, wider uh, growth area. It's it's something that you've come from from a seedling into this sort of space here. And it's something that has metamorphosized. It has transformed over the time as you have become more and more um, courageous and and bold and entrepreneurship and intuitive about trusting in your intuition because the ace of wands is a gift from the divine it's a gift from god it's that inspirational thought or moment of something a way of doing something that is very empowering and the king of wands is because you have taken that leap of faith you have decided to do things differently. You've gone through the star card. You've released, I'm getting expectations of both yourself and others. And you're now coming into this position of receiving things. This is the chariot. This is a faster momentum you might have otherwise have expected, but it's because you have through sheer um, will and intent, but also with that let go attitude, you have, um, 
I'm getting the word engineered, which is a very strange word for me to use. Thank you, Spirit. Engineered this. Uh, you've been the you've been on the train. You've been the one that's sort of supporting the driver of the train, the engineer. Um, as the train drivers, the universe has taken you on this journey, which is really, really lovely. And then you've got here this wonderful King of Wands. So this is about you taking an, um, a leadership role, my darling. This is about you, that you inspire people. This is about you having learned from challenges in the past, not seeing them as mistakes, but learning from them and being inspired to do then something a little bit uh, different as well. And uh, it is also about that alongside this chariot card and the king of wands is about you only paying attention to success not paying attention to failure at this time it does say here public speaking and this taking a leadership role so do do remember that there is within what you're doing you're constantly expanding and you're constantly growing so i'm going to wrap that up i feel i might just give you one more card thank you spirit they are encouraging you my darlings to trust yourself, to take that leap of faith. Um, it's time now, it's time. And this is okay because uh, this, this space that you're in, you've caused and created this exact present moment to happen. And this exact present moment is preparing you for this future for you. And this exact present moment is exactly where you're meant to be. So don't be afraid of what is the next step because the next step, you taking that step is exactly what you're meant to do. And I did do a, um, there's been a lot on the Daily Short Kiss, hasn't there, about two of swords and taking a leap of faith. So I really feel that this is, you're ready now for this new start. You're ready for this new start, my darling. So what a lovely reading for you. I trust that has helped those that have come to this reading and have resonated with it. I look forward to doing another reading for you on Monday now. Uh, but in the meantime, have a very lovely weekend and look out for some of your star sign readings. Take care, my darlings. So much love. Bye bye.